All right, so you're gonna put the uh, the coolant housing back on? Mm -hmm. Okay. You're gonna throw a little bit of the electric shield on the gasket. Yep. Cool. Trying to get it down even. All right, and Zelle Dork Wrench on 30 inch pounds. As far as I know. Uh oh, I missed one. Look, I missed one. Roz not messed up. Look at that. Uh oh. There we go. I'm just gonna start bringing them down. Wrong way. I just slowly bring them down. Just kind of going across pattern. All right. Got one there. One there. Work my way towards the end. All right, double check them. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's the coolant housing. And uh, I suppose uh, we need to fix the electrical cord before we can go much further because we can't put the circuit board back on until our cord is fixed. And our cord has a broken wire. <coughs> Cut! Okay, let's fix this cable. Let me see what's wrong. It's got a broken wire. Uh, let's see here. Maybe I could slide some of this back. Let's get this sheathing back out of the way. There we go. Now I got some wire to work with. Figure out how to get this thing apart. Come on. There you go. little piece of rubber out of here. Come on. Hey, you can do it. Pins do come out, but I don't know if you can see that in the camera. 
See that red thing up in there that holds that holds the pens? A little red piece in the center holding all four pens. It's gotta be it's it's about it's about right here to the face of it. It's gotta be slid forward to about right here and then the pins will come out. So I need to get in there with something and slide it forward. Maybe a pair of needle nose or something. Uh, dummy, you gotta pull this all the way out. Been a while since I've had one apart, okay? <laughs> Alright, uh, let me look down here. Oh yeah. And then you can, uh... There's a little tab. That's gonna be hard to see with a camera. A little tab right there. Okay, that's what's got me. A little tab, you just pop that tab up. That pin comes right out. So, yeah, uh, that's what we did wrong. Pop that one up. And that one up. And that one. I'm just working all four of them to get all four of them up. There we go. Come on, there you go. Now all the pins will come out. And we take note that the little hook thing is facing up. That's the green, yellow, and then the ground and hot. That's negative and power. So we can pull those out. There we go. Clean that. It looks pretty good. Looks like we can definitely reuse it. And uh, our pins are a little old, but they're okay. And uh, we'll fix the broken wire. Yeah. I think what I'll do is I'll get my uh, old man glasses on. Look at the end of this wire and see if it's corroded. It looks like it probably is. Pull this out of here. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's corroded quite badly. Let me get a pair of uh, wire strippers. They're in the other room. Cut. Alright, found a pair of snip strippers. I just want to show this on camera. See that? That green corrosion? It's pretty bad, so. We'll, uh,. I'm thinking that we take this pen and open this little connector up here. I do have a new pen, but I want to reuse this one just for sake's sake, just for the video's sake. Spread this open a little bit. There we go. Flatten that out good. There we go. And since it's a power wire, why don't we use a piece of red wire? solder it in right here like this on top of this other one what do you think just like that beautiful
nice and flat, so it'll go into the connector. There we go. thing back together green and red uh, ground and positive piece back in. Hard to see there. It goes like this. Make sure we're snapped in place. Push that guy down in there. There you go. All the way to the back. Sure the pins won't push in when we connect it up. Yep, they're all good and they're all in place. Put this back. So we get a nice seal. And what am I gonna do? Just to be safe? A little bit of conformal coating. Right here on that back side, just to be safe. Pop this thing back on. There we go. And now we can come back here and we can repair this wire back here where it's not uh, not corroded. That looks to me like the corrosion. Let's see how far back the corrosion goes. Okay, that looks pretty good. So if we go about right here, what do you think? Let's go about right here. And piece of this uh, shrink tubing. Come in here like this. And slide it back here out of the way. So it doesn't get hot. I want to take this uh, this old wire. You see how it's tarnished? And just sort of just sort of get some of that tarnishing off of it. Just so we know we got a really good solder connection. We'll solder them together and shrink it. Hey, dummy. Turn your gun back on.